Hi everyone, uh, this video I will show you how to operate and all the functions of our portable x-ray. So here let's take a look at our portable x-ray. In the front is the display with four function keys. And on the top is the power switch button. And on the right hand is exposure button. So first I will turn on the, the portable x-ray by long pressing this power switch button to turn on. And after starting up, all icons in the display will light up in the full screen about for like one second to check whether the, there is any problems with the display. Okay, first, uh, let's take a look at these four function keys. Uh, the first is the mode key. You can select the adult or the keyed mode. And here is the tooth selection. You can select uh, the tooth you want to shoot. And uh, here the up and down, uh, which means you can increase or reduce the exposure time. And uh, for example, if you want to set the default exposure by yourself, first you have to adjust the exposure time to the required exposure time by pressing the up and down key, for example, here. And then after select the exposure time, you can long press the up and down key for three seconds. You can hear the device will give a beep twice. That means the time has been set at default time. So uh, that means every time you select this tooth, the exposure time will be the this, uh, this exposure time. So if you want to reset the exposure time just by long pressing the up and down key for three seconds, after the device give two beeps, keep pressing for about 10 seconds. Okay, the device gives a long beep and release the button to restore the factory state. state. Okay, now I will, uh, I will expose, I will show you how to expose uh, when this check icon uh, light up in the, uh, in the screen. That means the system is ready for exposure. And uh, press the exposure button, for example, press the exposure button for once. Here the 60 countdown will show up in the screen. So during this period, if you want to cancel the exposure, you can press any four of these keys. So I will show you, I press any four of these keys, the countdown will disappear. That means the exposure has been canceled. And if you want to exposure, uh, for example, I press the exposure key once. And you, if you want to exposure, you have to long press the exposure key for like three seconds. If you are not to long press the exposure key, you just uh, press the exposure key quickly for like, and uh, you can see here the E01 arrow code means you release the exposure key too fast. So, If you want to delete the exposure key, just long press the up and down key for three seconds. The error codes will disappear. So if you want to exposure, just long press the exposure key for once. And after the 60 countdown shows up, you have to long press the exposure key for three seconds. Okay, that means this icon shows up means uh, indicate that the tube is under cooling. The exposure is finished. So after the exposure is finished, we can check the KV value and uh, the current value of the current exposure. So if you want to check the voltage of uh, the last exposure, you can uh, press the teeth key and uh, then press the up key together. Here is the, uh, I will press again to let you see, here is the voltage of the last exposure. And we release the, these two keys, the, uh, the data will disappear. So if we want to check uh, the, uh, the current of last exposure, we can press the teeth key and uh, press the down key. And you can see that it, it shows the current of the last exposure. Okay. So next I will introduce another function is we can uh, view the cumulative dose by uh, pressing, the, uh, pressing the mode key and then the up key. Here is showing, is showing the cumulative dose value of the device is displayed on the screen. 
So by this number of those, we can know how many times a user has been used it. So press the man, press the uh, mode key and the up key again to exactly the, uh, to to cancel this viewing state. And uh, we can press and hold the mode key and the up key for five seconds. Okay, for five seconds, the device will clear all the data. Okay. So next, I will show you how to lock the device. Uh, the reason why we have to lock the device is because uh, sometimes when we are having the uh, exhibition or uh, we don't want to misoperate the portable x-ray, uh, we have to lock the device. Uh, we can just long press the, uh, we can just uh, press the Mold key and TS key for once. Here the little lock icon shows up in the display, which means the, the device has been locked. So uh, you, can pr you, can, you can also select the mode, select the T's and adjust the exposure time, but you cannot expose. If you press this key, it will beep twice, means uh, this device cannot be exposed because it's been locked. So uh, if you want to uh, unlock the device, you can just press the mode and T key together. Uh, the lock icon will disappear, which means the, the device is unlocked. So every, everything is normal and uh, the exposure key is also, uh, is also working. Okay, I will cancel the exposure. And we also have one function about the battery protection is that if you leave the device uh, for eight, eight minutes, the device will automatically shut down to save the battery. So this is also one function we have. And uh, that's all for today's operation and function introductions. If you have any questions, please kindly contact with us. Thank you.